for it, and we'll even pay for some extra hours that you don't cover. So I give, uh, I want to applaud Sam Pablo for that. And, uh, and I want to thank um, all of you and the ACLU for really being great partners on good work that's happening in Contra Costa. You know, there's a lot, a lot of um, accomplishments that have happened over the last year or two, and it's really the result of a great active, activist base. I have not seen this level of activism in my 20 years on the Board of Supervisors. So, and let me go further. You may say the ACLU is not anti-Trump, but we are, against, we are against, and I know the ACLU stands, against all the racist, um, xenophobic, um, anti-civil libertarian, hateful things that this president does, and we need to call them out, and we need to do things about them locally, right? And that's what you're all doing, and I know why you're here. And I'm really proud that we have these three great um, folks in, in county government, our, our new district attorney. I am really proud that our board appointed um, the best candidate that applied. And, uh, she happened to, so we happen to break the gender barrier, the race barrier, and this appointment, but she is by far the best candidate, and I'm and we need to elect her yeah. outright to this position in June. And, I can say this, and, and, and the two lawyers in our public defender's office, um, Ali and uh, Jeff. So when we work on some tough, tough issues, they have they have been amazing. So when our board approved a program, sort of a rapid response program to help immigrant families and protect them from deportation. Ali really helped develop the details of that program and we worked together on getting countywide support. So thank you for this activist space, Ali, and your, your um, passion and activism there because we would not have had that had there not been sort of alliances between people here in West County and people in other parts of the county. And when we did things like eliminate juvenile justice fees on um, yeah. families um, for kids in juvenile hall. Uh, Jeff was with the Racial Justice Coalition on that, so I, I am really thankful for um, your, your, uh, your efforts and the great efforts we have here. So I just wanted to say, um, you're all here to keep us accountable and to keep us continuing to push in this direction. And um, you know, for those of us who fought against the West County jail expansion, even though we lost that battle, yeah. it really formed a lot of energy around these other issues that we have been successful on. So I think it's important to remember that even when we lose a particular issue, we don't lose the whole the whole war. That we're fighting a larger battle and we can be successful and I'm really proud of the progressive uh, work that's happening here in Contra Costa County. So thank, thanks and uh, Antonio, thank you for your leadership. Thank you.